Yeah, this is Jordan. He's going to show you the new uh, AI program we've got for the saw jet for your Raptor. All right, so what you're going to do is you're first going to have your slab over there and you're going to scan it on the D2. You'll notice those two targets on that. We're going to use those to locate where the slab is on the table later. Once you scan the slab, it's going to print out this barcode and you're going to stick that sticker on the slab. So that's now attached to the slab. Now, once you get into building the countertop, you design it in the D2 software, it's going to be associated with that slab and you can do all your vein matching. You can draw everything out in 3D so you can see what it'll look like. Once you've done all that, you bring it over to our, your, our machine, you put the slab on the table, you scan this barcode, uh, and then that's what associates it with the machine. That's gonna take a picture of the slab as well. So there's gonna be a camera above the machine that takes a photo. D2 camera. A D2 camera. And then you're gonna click the AI import, and that's gonna pull up the photo, take the parts that you've already drawn in the D2, shift them and move them around based on these two targets, uh, it's then going to add all your saw tool paths and jet tool paths based on the material type. So this one's quartz, so it's going to extend all the saw cuts off the slab. And it's also automatically adding these relief cuts to relieve pressure in the stone. Also, it knows which lines are miters and which ones are vertical cuts based on the 3D view in the D2 software. Now that you've done all that, you've hit one button at the machine. Uh, and you're ready to go. You can hit cycle start. And that's everything. Everything will be loaded up through CNC console, so your operator will be able to visually see what, the, what it is they're cutting, and uh, they can just run their program. They don't have to do any manual tool pathing at the machine.